Today's finally the day that I've been waiting for over the past six years. I gotta tell you, one of the great things about being a parent is having good kids. My wife and I are pretty lucky to have three awesome kids who aren't a drain on the household. I've been kind of holding the secret over the last six months about my son, and we're gonna share that with you today. But first, I have some police officers that wanna talk about this car, so we're gonna have to hop in the C8 and head out of here. You can see we got some snow here in Louisville and there's a little bit more coming that I think is gonna cover the ground. So it's not a good thing to be driving this car in the snow, but it's kind of something that we have to do. Luckily, where we're headed to, there's no snow on the ground. people that went 26 10 and 10 for the three months you know yep. all right and we are here and yes you just saw my son uh walk up to me i was on the phone with a corvette customer and we got here just in the nick of time as he walked out and uh of course due to covid restrictions we can't do some of the things that we wanted to do but let's go see what he's doing what's up buddy congratulations yeah. doing good yep get your pen you haven't got pinned yet no that's what you guys are doing Oh, we gotta do that, really Who's awesome. Who's gonna record? <laughs> <laughs> so that's where, that's how your camera goes in? Yeah. Okay, that's interesting. So their body cameras are not the Axon body cameras that you probably see most police officers have. Um, they're actually like Motorola, like Android phones, which is really weird. Is there any, is there any phone capabilities on it at all? You can make 911, that's about it. Okay, sounds good. So yeah, so I was wondering about that when I saw a phone. I mean, it literally looks like this. And I was like, what? How's that work? And he said there's a pocket in their uniform. And now you can kind of see, you know, you can kind of see, see where that's going to go. Can I borrow your taser for a minute? <laughs> Dang it. Trying to get me fired before I even start. <laughs> I mean, it might be worth it, right? Tage you. All right, so do you want to do the honor and pin the badge on the donkey? <laughs> oh, no, 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 that's pin the tail on the donkey. Oh, yeah, my bad. Wrong. So, wrong. back here? <laughs> where does this go? Where? <laughs> right, see I where figured. those two holes are? No. Don't poke yourself, please. Oh, my goodness gracious. What's going on here? You know what you're doing? I'm making sure I get the uh, thing out. <gasps> that's what she said. Okay. There you go. Perfect. Now you can't take it off. Right. <laughs> Perfect. It's official. Uh, so for the past six months, oh man, you're going to hit me for this, Zach. I'm sorry. For the past six months, we've been calling him Officer Doofy. Special Officer Doofy. <laughs> so, <laughs> so I don't think we can call him Officer Doofy anymore. So apparently he's Officer Davenport. He's real legit now. Yep. <laughs> All right. It never fails. Uh, the couple right there, they are instructors here at the academy and uh, they wanna, they're getting ready to retire. So they're gonna order a Corvette from me. So that's pretty awesome. I wasn't expecting really to come up here to, to sell cars. It was, it's, it's to celebrate my son's uh, achievements in life. So uh, we're gonna go to dinner or lunch, I guess, and get something and it's freezing here, absolutely freezing. So I'm gonna get in the car and go get something to eat. Before we get to Zach and his uh, experience in the academy, I got a quick question for you. That right there I'm experimenting with and I wanna know, would you purchase this limited run hoodie if I made it available? Just throw it down in the comment section or shoot me a text. We're gonna get lunch with Zach. Uh, he's got like a two hour break and then we gotta get back to the academy to finish up his day. Um, so I figured I'd ask him just a couple questions. Academy, is it easy or hard? It is all right. There's some challenging parts in it, like law, but I got through it. Uh, law, the law part was really tough. Yeah. Yeah, kind of 88, I think. You actually passed something? You passed the test? <laughs> passed me. <laughs> I should be careful now. You could write me a ticket, can't, can't you? What was the fun part? Uh, the range and emergency vehicle operations, Evo. Like you drove fast? Yeah. You don't drive fast. Come on, dude. Are you kidding <laughs> me? Fast. So, what um, did you do over 100? No, 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 no. You can't do that on those tracks. Okay, so you didn't drive fast. <laughs> did you get tased? Yes. Can we get that video? I don't think so. To the department uh, that he's on, if I could get that video of him be getting tased, I would really love it. What else? What else happened? Uh, tased, OC spray again. Um, Evo, gun range. Well, we had a interesting uh, 
conversation with another YouTuber who's called Audit the Audit. Wait, what? Who? Audit the Audit? Yeah. I love Audit the Audit. Are you kidding me? That's like, like I don't watch a lot of YouTube, but Audit the Audit is the one I do watch. So you, so you, you know what this guy looks like? No, it was just a vocal. Uh, oh, he didn't show his face. No. Oh, oh, I, I was like, no way. Audit, Does he audit. Not show his face he on... never show. You do not know what he looks like. Oh. So, and if wow. you don't know what audit the audit is, watch the channel. I'll link it down below. It's absolutely awesome. Um, he basically takes police interactions and he, oh, what's what? How's he say at the beginning? He uh, deciphers through the who, what, right, and wrong. Right. So, and then at the end of the video, he gives the police officers uh, a grade and he gives the people interaction, the civilians, he gives them a grade as well. And I think he's pretty fair. I think he's pretty fair and balanced. So what'd you learn from him? Uh, he just went, talked about like some of the psychological stuff that goes on in the police world and what to, what to expect and what to do with uh, when you come into certain encounters like the otters, like just be professional and all that stuff. Awesome. All right, buddy. Congratulations. <laughs> a lot of hard work over the last six months. And um, you guys can tell him down in the comments section. He doesn't believe me. I, I mean, police officer. I know I have a lot of police officers that follow me. Tomorrow night is his first shift. You've got to do a desk pop. Here we go. Do it. Yes. <laughs> right? Day one. Day one, do your desk pop. Get it out of the way. You don't want to be made fun of a year or two years from now. I was like, you've never done a desk pop? Are you freezing? I am. It is absolutely freezing out here. But, uh, and there's a Tesla store <laughs> No, we're not going yes. to the Tesla store. She's, there's a Tesla store nearby. She wants to go to Tesla. I'm, I want but my car. We just wanted to share this vlog with you. We really appreciate you being in. It's not part of our normal vlogs, more of a family vlog, but, you know, proud parent moment. You know, he's 25 years old and the Eagles left the nest and, you know. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Zach. Oh, thank you. <laughs>